Hello guys, welcome back. And yes, it is once again the story of planning the gross gang episodes. Anything more than just interesting after the Friday the 13th episode? Well, on this week where there's seven episodes left, there's gonna be an interesting one. So at the beginning of the episode, Barry is outside looking for squirrels to play with and then Jake interrupts Barry all of a sudden which he doesn't say hello like a normal person would do he would instead he would come up with something that would be very unusual for someone to bring up with when they're about to start up a conversation so instead of Jake saying hello Barry he says have you seen Chip and then all of a sudden, Barry gets very, very mad at Jake, telling him not to mention the name of Chip since they've been in an insane grudge for four years and Barry doesn't even want to think of the name Chip. Even if it's a potato chip or the character that I've been showing you guys throughout the episodes. So all of a sudden, Jake gets a bit silly and continues to bring up Chip and then Barry warns Jake if you keep going with this then I'll keep up the grudge with you as well and then they settled down like Jake got the warning and then they finally settled down and then some hours pass Barry looks around the bushes to play with some rabbits and same scenario Jake interrupts Barry again Jake is so much into getting chip but this time he interrupts him for a different reason this time Jake asks Barry for a coconut and then Barry says this is not a safari and while he's saying all that suddenly just by mistake he mentions the name chip so he says something like looks like chip ended up somewhere in a safari or chip got lost in the maze but he just mistakenly says it but then, intentionally, Jake repeats the name Chip as he runs away from Barry. So Jake yells out Chip at least 10 times. And then Barry starts running away from him too, but from a different direction, from a different perspective. And all of a sudden, Skullbone finds both of them and takes them to the monitor to see a video footage of Chip actually getting lost. So all together, Jake, Barry and Skullbone watch the clip of the event that Chip ended up falling down the drain. And then Barry invites Brian over to watch the footage. But then Brian has a feeling of total suspicion and ending up not knowing how did all this happen so Brian and Jake feel a lot different than what Barry does but then at the end of the episode Barry runs around gibberish but of course happy and overexcited that his biggest enemy is dead he's running really really happy and he's just running around just like a total garbage man just crazily he just crazily runs around, mentally crazily. And so that's for the episodes for tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode plan. And tomorrow, that's how the episode comes out.